Welcome to our easy Shopify tutorial on how to create and set up discount codes on Shopify. Whether you're a Shopify store owner or planning to launch an online store, understanding how to use discount codes can boost your marketing efforts and sales potential. Now, think of it from a buyer's perspective. Having a product's discount can trigger a sense of urgency for a limited time opportunity, for example, which can significantly increase your sales. After we know about the huge potential of using coupons to boost your sales, let's get into it. There are two options of discounts on Shopify, discount code and automatic discount. When it comes to discount code, this involves creating a code that we can share via email or SMS marketing to our subscribers on social media or even display on our Shopify store. This way, buyers feel unique as they own the discount coupon and the sense of urgency can be greater, especially if there's an expiration date on the coupon code. Now, the automatic discount, this means that the discount will be automatically added to the product during checkout. And we can advertise this through email marketing to our subscribers on social media or even display on our store as well. And this type of coupon is convenient and more user friendly because there is no need to deal with like adding coupons during checkout. And this could also be a surprise discount for those who activate the coupon and didn't know that such a deal existed. However, the sense of urgency is slightly lower and the buyer feels less unique. All right, let's jump here in my computer and get this start with. So first you navigate from your Shopify dashboard to the discount section right here, and then you click create discount. And then this pop-up comes up and then you see many types of discounts. Now let's go over each discount type available by Shopify and what's good for. By the way, these types are available for both discount codes and automatic discount. So let's start with the first one, amount of products. This is the kind of coupon that most of us are familiar with. It offers discount on single items or product collections, which is a group of products. And then we have buy X and get Y. And this is a great option for complementary products. For example, you could buy a, a hammock and get a hammock strap for free. Another option to use this discount type is for BOGO deals, B-O-G-O, -O, which means buy one, get one free. Next one is amount of order. This can be great for those who want to increase the card value. For example, buy $100 worth of product and get 10% off. And a coupon won't work unless the card value is at least a hundred dollars. Now let's go over the last one, which is free shipping. Now, this is also great for increasing the cart value. You can set a minimum total order and the buyer will get free shipping. And this can be a good option for stores that do not already offer free shipping. Now let's create a new discount together. For this tutorial, we'll create an amount of order discount. Okay. So you click here. Before we move on here, don't miss out on the upcoming guides and tutorials that can help you master Shopify and other e-commerce platforms. Subscribe to our channel, turn on the notifications and stay updated. All right. So let's create a discount code that customers can apply during checkout. And here you give your discount a name and or you can generate a random code just clicking here. But in this case, I'm going to type something like YouTube example, right? In this part here, we can set up the discount value and then we can either choose by percentage or fixed amount. Let's go with 15% off and then you have the next steps which is the minimum purchase requirements and customer eligibility we can see that we have no minimum requirements or we have minimum purchase amount or minimum quantity of items i am going to opt for no minimum requirements and also for all customers but hey make sure that you explore this area. It's very interesting. For example, you could select a specific customer segment and then you click here and browse and then you can just aim for customers who haven't purchased or for customers who have purchased more than once and so on. So this is great. This is great here. Take your time 
to explore what Shopify offers you here. Moving on, we do have the maximum discount users. You can limit the number of times that this discount can be used in total, or you can limit to one customer, one use per customer. And I'm going to choose here to limit to one use per customer. And now can we combine discounts? And before I answer this question, let me know if you have any other questions or you need clarifications on any of these topics right here, this tutorial so far, please leave a comment below. So to answer your question, yes, you can choose if customers can combine discounts in this section right here. There's this combinations section, and this is our discount name. And then you have the options can be combined with product discounts, order discounts, or shipping discounts. And then once you do, you want to uh, combine, you just click on whatever discounts that you want to combine. So in this case, I am not going to select any types of combinations. I'm not going to combine discounts. Um, and then the last step is to set the active date. So you can plan here a start date and start time. And this section is basically to define the duration for which the discount will be active, including the starting date right here and ending date. Now, if you wish to not have an expiration date for the ongoing promotions, you simply click here, save discount already. However, if you want to select an ending date, make sure to check the box here, set an end date and put the end date that you desire. And for this example, I'm just going to leave without an ending date. And then I'm going to save discount right here. And then you can come here to discount. This is our discount is live and we can check everything here. Now, let me show you how to set up an automatic discount. So click here and create discount and choose the discount type. And this time we could go with amount of products Then we select here. And then on the method, we click automatic discount. And then this changes a few things down here. The first option is to write the title. So I'm just going to write here YouTube example. And then the next step is to set the discount values and either as percentage or fixed amount. And I'll just go with percentage again. I'm going to place 15% off and then you choose specific collections or specific products to apply this discount. And I'm going to choose a couple of specific products for this example. So you click here, browse, and I'm going to choose this adjustable yoga mat and let's say this anti-slip yoga socks right here. And I'll just add with all the variants. And the next section is the availability. And this discount is automatically applied to all sales channels. And then if you have point of sale active, you can also offer it there. And then the next section is the minimum purchase requirements. And this is where you choose to place the minimum purchase amount like X dollars, for example, or a minimum quantity of items. For this example, I'm going to select this option right here, minimum purchase of $10. This discount will be available for customers that have a minimum purchase of $10. And basically the rest is the same as before. And then you save discount. And so it was created. You come here to the discount section and then you can see all the status right here. You can see the method that's automatic. And the first one that we did is code. Now let's test the discount codes that we have created. And the first one that we're going to test is this discount code that we created. All right. So here's our website and I'm just going to choose one product like, like this one. For example, I'm going to add to cart, go to checkout, and then I'm going to write here in this section, the discount code, which is the YouTube example correct and then i'm going to click apply and check it out the discount is working and applied giving 15 percent off so one dollar and fifty off it shows that it worked now let's test our automatic discount codes all right let's go back here to the main page and then the second one was this anti-slip socks your cart 
and you can already see here the discount was automatically applied and then you can see here the difference on the checkout as well you can see here the total savings the automatic total savings so both discounts that we created are working perfectly. So setting up discount codes is just one of many features that Shopify offers to help you optimize your online store and attract more customers. Now, remember that the key to successful discount strategies lies in understanding your customers' needs and shopping behaviors. Plus, it's important to understand your business strategy and how the discount impacts your profit margin. Keep moving forward and see you next time.